What is up, everybody? So, you follow me, you know we were very busy today. So I went and did a couple measures for some station work. Uh, I've done, of course you knew about the window job, the 12 windows that we had today that they installed. Uh, they're not done. Uh, they ran into a lot of issues <laughs> on this house, which we kind of already knew. I knew there was gonna be issues. I knew this was gonna roll into uh, possible two days. So uh, let me show you what we did. And when we all get said and done, I'll show you some before and afters of what, how it was when we first got here. But other than that, let's go do a side inspection. All right. So these are the, when these windows came in, these are the ones that I said that, um, uh, if you remember, if you go back to when these windows actually arrived, I made, I dropped the sash lower to make this window look taller. Uh, and this is the, the trim out that we ended up having to do. Um, so it made this window look so, this house look a lot bigger. So doing, all right, so this is, like I said, these, this is what we did. Uh, this is where the, where they've kind of, we're, we're starting to get it installed. There's 12 windows on this house. Uh, this is asbestos siding, so we're having to deal with that nonsense. But as you can see, they had a lot of wood rot underneath. It's old termites. It's just a lot of nastiness. We had to replace a, a seal, which took them some time, you know, so it was completely gone. Like the whole half of the seal was completely gone. Uh, we still got this little window here to do, which is that one there. And we got that one in. And they have more around this backside. But these are old, old, <laughs> old encasement windows. So these are the metal galvanized frames. Um, the Gavin, uh, so that's one window pane. That's that little one right there, the one that's about to go in, a little 19 incher. But this is galvanized steel, you know, uh, single sheet of glass, you know, just a big hunk of junk. Um, of course, people stunned coming by, I wanna buy them, I wanna buy them. So, uh, for displays and stuff like that. So I'll probably hold on to them for a little bit. But, so anyways, the trim's gonna get like that all the way around. Uh, as you can see, like with dropping that sash, instead of them being those old encasements, dropping that sash down the way I did um, allowed this house to be taller. Um, we're not caulked on the outside. We just, like I said, we just got some trim up and got it to where I can at least show something. Um, I don't know if you can hear them, but they're still cutting out window seals so we can do a uh, cut back. Um, but this little window, Little window's gonna go up there on the top. We still gotta cut that sheetrock out, but I ain't worried about that today. This is the only one in a the vinyl. They don't know I'm here. So, that's gonna get trimmed out just like the one in the front. They're all gonna get trimmed out the same way. Boy, look at them boys go. Look at this. That's Chris, that's one of the helpers. There's Andrew, he's one of the top installers. <laughs> they never, they never know when I'm just gonna pop in on them or, or show up or uh, you know when I'm gonna when I'm gonna show up to go live or if I'm gonna if I'm gonna pop in. So that right there, guys, is a whole lot of work. That's a 12 foot cargo trailer. That is full. That's probably gonna cost me every bit of 100 120 dollars to dump every bit of it so i would take y'all inside and let y'all see the uh i would take y'all inside and let y'all see the actuation of these windows but i know it's going to be extremely loud in there so um we will do that probably tomorrow uh, i know i know jessica's been scheduling a lot today um but i'll definitely be back here tomorrow to do a final walkthrough um and we'll like i said i'll do a walkthrough on the windows and uh show you what they are and how they operate from inside the house so but here it is seven eight o'clock almost eight o'clock and boys is still here working and like i said you saw you saw him this morning you know eight o'clock at the office loading these windows up so old house old house causes a lot of issues a lot of problems for installs uh no matter how good you are at measuring windows you're gonna 
<laughs> is going to have is going to throw a challenge. Uh, every one of these windows uh, indirectly got installed a different way. Um, like that one there, we had no cutback. That one we only had to cut back one side of the sheetrock. Uh, that one there, we had to cut all of it out. The one on the other side, we had to cut the header out and the bottom, and you know, so the seal, and then we replaced the seal on the other one. So it was a lot of work, uh, but and each one was a little bit different. So the original measure when I came out here, all three of these front line windows were different sizes, and uh, I, I wanted them to the same. I wanted them to be the same as close as possible. Uh, so I was able to get uh, these three and the three on the side all the same size um, Like I said a little bit more finessing on our end, but I think it came out really really nice uh, Especially when they do when they do come back and do their siding uh, I think it's going to make this home look really really cute for for the age of it that it is uh, Like I said other than that y'all be good And I'm trying to get these guys up and out of here so I can go home and see my beautiful wife y'all have a good night. Thanks